Recently, I played a game called Boomerang FU, where you're a cute little fruit character who tries to annihilate your opponents with a boomerang. It's actually sort of fun, but more importantly, it made me remember how the original Boomerang FU came to us from Wizards as one of the worst cards ever, Worldwake's Razor Boomerang. Razor Boomerang is a three mana equipment that costs two to equip. Once you get it on a creature, you can tap the creature, unattach Razor Boomerang, and bounce it back to your hand to deal a whopping one damage. I may not know much about horses, but I know a lot about doing anything for one dollar. This means that it takes five mana and tapping down one of your creatures to deal a single damage. Now here you're thinking, but wait, there's an upside. It's repeatable. Why it is true that you can use Razor Boomerang over and over again, I'm not so sure that's an upside. Poking yourself in the eye with a fork is technically repeatable, but that doesn't make it an upside. I'd argue that every time you activate Boomerang, you decrease your odds of winning the game, which oddly makes Boomerang FU the perfect description of the card.